Hello everyone, welcome back. What is the common problem for those all who are using the free trading view and they do not wish to go for the premium one to get the more indicator. So the problem for them is to limitation of the indicator. For the free version, they only allow us to put three indicator, but we are the human, we always need a more things, right? So if I need a five indicator, but I don't want to go premium, what? So today we are going to discuss, solve that issue and merge the indicator that we can use within our limitation but still without free. So before we move forward friends, please like this video and if you are new in this channel, subscribe this channel. So definitely you will get this valuable video in the future as well. I have already covered the part one which is for RSI and MFI. Today we are going to discuss on VWAP plus EMA. So be with me and enjoy this video. So what you need to do first is that click over here indicator. Once you reach here, just type simple VWAP. Once you click over here, this is the first indicator. We will click on that. That's you can see it's already plotted. Go over here, look for your indicator and three dots. Once you get three dots, click on the source. Once you get the source, just go down over here and you need to copy control A right click copy go over here create a new indicator and then just paste it right so we have this one or we copy now we go back again we delete and here we need to amend for r what we are looking for merge so to save the time what i have done i have saved the one command for that which we can use here i will explain you don't worry what is that so it will be easy for you so only we have the all the uh, coding here for this vweb so we are not going to be disturbed that we just go further to down and paste it what we have so here i'm going to be explaining to you what is this this is for the ema it's an exponential moving average so first is the i put length length is equal to input 9 9 is my default means if i don't want to 9 i can put over here 20 50 then min value is 1 what is this one it is like you know when you want to change to the any moving average from 9 to 10 11 12 1 is the ideal one if i'll put 5 then if next one will be 9 14 like this 19 in the difference of 5 5 it will jump but i want to because you know our in trading community people have a different mindset they like different things someone like nine someone like 10 11 so we'll keep it as one source what is the source it's input the title the close if if you like close you can take close if you like opening and then you can choose on that out what is out out is for that to a ema so here i'll put out is equal to ta ema the EMA is a code for the exponential moving average. If I would like to take the simple moving average, what will I do? I'll just change over here S. But today we are going to discuss EMA. So I'll put over here. I would equal to the EMA. The here source will take. This is the default line and the length over here, the close. Now, next one is the plot. What we are going to plot. Plot means we want to see over here along with the VWAP. So I'll put plot. I want to plot this EMA out color by default I'll put red then transfer zero and line width one if you put over here two, your EMA will become thicker that you can adjust in your setting also so don't worry about that title EMA that it will help you to choose the color when you go to the setting so once you're done over here just save it will ask you what you want to save so here I'll just put uh, VWAP plus EMA so now done I have no error then I'll put on chart once I'll click on the chart you can see over here now we have a VWAP as well as to the EMA but it looks like a uh, like congested right so I'll make it clear to go to setting I don't want upper band if you want you can keep it and I don't want background I'll go over here make it thicker you can choose any color whichever you like if like black you can choose black for your VWAP EMA here it's a red if you like yellow orange whichever the color you can click okay now you can see a clear VWAP and your moving average is over here but that's what we are not looking for we are looking for multiple two three four five so now back to our coding so once we come back over here, 
over here no need to do again hard work just copy double click and put over here now the trick is here because my second one i don't want to add nine i i want default 21 so i'll put here one because i already put len so i cannot repeat so i need to add one more one out also one sre one source mean length plot one color now I, I don't want color red i want green so i'll put green and all the way same at the end if you want to you can change to one two or you can put your name also once done this amendment then i'll go over here save once i'll save it back to the all everything again i'll go to setting now here you can see my ema ema1 here if you want to put the name default also you can change so here is the default one if i don't want 9 and 21 but i want here 21 i want here 50. so now you can see over there it will change automatically upper band lower band band other one this become my black color my, because my black is favorite so i always take black color often okay so now this is the clear for that a vweb and two moving average done so easy and i hope this will help you to put a number of your moving average on the one indicator so friends if you like this video please subscribe this channel and share with your friends thank you take care bye bye